In this video, we'll show you how to create a solar study rendering. Solar studies simulate the movement of the sun through a scene, so you can see where shadows are going to fall throughout the course of a day. This is especially useful in urban planning when, for example, you might need to adhere to limits on the amount of shadow a proposed building is allowed to cast on public spaces. You will need an image created with sun properties from an application such as Revit. The correct geographic location must be included in the model. Solar studies are composed of multiple rendered frames, so make sure you have enough cloud credits available before starting a rendering. If you cancel the rendering at any point, no cloud credits will be deducted from your account. Before a rendering starts, you will be presented with a window informing you of the number of cloud credits required. Navigate to the scene you want to render and mouse over the thumbnail. Click Render as Solar Study. From the Render Settings window, you can select to start an end date. The default is the same day, so you can see the sun's progress throughout one day. Usually you'll want to select the approximate times for sunrise and sunset for the region in question. Interval is the amount of time between image simulations. For example, if you select one hour, an image will be rendered for every hour of the specified time period. Resolution is determined by the existing image. Once you have specified your settings, click Start Rendering. Note that you can also do the rendering from your application. For example, in Revit 2014, you can do this from the Rendering Cloud dialog box. You might have more options available to you when you do this, such as accessing sunrise and sunset times. In our example, we are doing the rendering in the portal, but if you do it from a desktop application, you will see a preview grid of all the images that will be created in the final render. This is so you can adjust exposure, saturation, and other settings. No cloud credits are required for this preview. To get an estimate of the remaining rendering time, hover over the progress bar under the rendering thumbnail. The finished solar study displays a time and date for the simulation on the upper left corner. Each interval image is displayed for one second as the movie plays. You can see that as the sunlight diminishes in the scene, artificial light takes its place. You can download the solar study using the download solar study option. This creates a zip file containing separate files for each image of the solar study. Each image contains a transparency mask. Whether you see the background depends on what program you're using to view the image. 